What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person. That's Mike. I'm yes. Chris. What's up? Uh, Nosferatu, episode six. We're getting there, man. This is... It's going fast, brother. Yeah, this is the Hourglass. The Hourglass. Three the Hourglass. Um, I love Vic's mom. I'm telling you, I love Linda. I really like yeah, Virginia I mean, Cole's she, performance been in these episodes. better than, than what I've... I guess enjoyed from from the first uh yeah. from what I didn't enjoy I should say. I wasn't a big really big fan of her. I know you um, weren't. But I mean I guess I mean there were some cool scenes with her. Obviously there were some emotional scenes with her and Yeah. yeah it was This season she's know, just fun. I just like it. She's just fun. Yeah, and it's cool. She kind of like by the end there she kind of like realized all right let me kind of believe in my daughter my husband or my ex-husband is saying that she yeah. has a gift she's saying she has a gift lou saying she has a gift all these kind of things so it's kind of cool um i mean we don't really want to go too much into like no but you know what episode, but we got a lot of was, listen, we got a lot of questions, we didn't get and questions that wasn't, about right. that i wanted exactly. to just mention that um yeah, yeah. no me too me too I'm, so she yeah so she told her parents and now yeah. they're all together working to to build the wraith and you know she's yeah. kind of losing hope but everyone's like hey hey we got your back um, yeah, let's just repair the motorcycle in the kitchen. It's cool. Yeah, I was like, when when her mom's like, they're gonna put it in the kitchen. I'm like, what? Why are you going yeah. in the kitchen? Like, yeah. Anyway, whatever. Yeah. Uh, I mean, so, she did have a garage. Remember, that's where she's yeah, doing all our artwork I stuff, know. right? So I don't know why. All right. All right anyway. So anyway, all right. So listen. Um, we got so a lot we got a questions. bunch of questions and a few comments. We're gonna get through those real. But first, I always want to do a poll. Uh, yeah. we did a poll cat. It's, uh, is Wayne, do you think Wayne is a strong creative? We threw it on Facebook and YouTube. Like we always do Facebook about 50, 50 YouTube. We've got about 50, 56% say yes. 22% say no. And the mm. other 22% say maybe. So maybe I think they got their most answers. Most people right? think most people think so. Oh, well, we're going to yeah. talk about it because I, I, yeah. I, I don't know what to think to be honest. So let's talk about it. So, all right. All right. Let's, um, Let's so all right. Let's go. Our first comment is from Jesse. Thank you, Jesse. Yeah. This is Jesse says, "Thank goodness Lou is okay." I agree. Um, and uh, she says, "I think it's a bit creepy that Wayne's dad showed up in Manx's car." So, so yeah, that's he looked where, cool. He looked cool as shit. No, that surprised me. I was like, "What?" And then yeah, yeah. So I know we got a kinda... couple questions. Uh, so yeah. let's let's start there. We'll all right. So. That. Yeah, so I mean, this is kind of a combination. Jesse obviously talks about Wayne's, you know, Craig showing up in the. Right. So this goes right into what Frank um, posted for us. He said, "Did Craig man manifest himself into the wraith, or was it Wayne's ability that made it happen?" What do you think? Sort it. Yeah, I mean, I you know I don't know what to think. Hmm. I don't know what to think. Let's talk about Wayne. So, can, in going with that, Michelle also asked, "Did Wayne's power hmm. awaken because he's in the wraith?" Because yeah. he seems to talk to the dead, obviously, as well as open the window with his mind. Now, yeah, I gonna be honest, mm. I don't remember. Now that happened to be something from the book. I do, I do remember the butterfly. Okay, I, him like beginning to change is that he's like, oh, I'm gonna call you whatever, Sonny. Yeah, and then he yeah. and then he rips it. I and that was something, but I can't remember for the life of me if that was like something. I thought it was the wraith. I thought it was a right. No, I mean, he that. he looked at it. He looked at it at the door handle, and it un and like right, but and let's, it rolled but down. Let, but but let's let's just say this real quick because yeah. don't forget he is in the wraith and he is becoming a part of Manx. So see, I don't think so. Let me let me answer this. Let's mm -hmm. try. And, I I don't want to forget about like all right because we have a few different things here. So do I think I'm going to go to the first part? Do I think that Craig manifested himself or not? If Craig man of listen, you got to remember, Manx didn't see who Wayne was talking to, right? So if it was an ability, even for for Wayne himself to to by being in the wraith, wouldn't Manx notice Craig up here? I think so, so. I think that's more of Craig's ability. I mean, um, Wayne's ability, unless there is a part of Craig that was maybe even a creative, a strong creative, and that's the reason. Wayne may be so powerful is because maybe there's a part of Craig and Craig was able to manifest himself. Um, I'm not, I mean, I'm not sure it, that's, that's kind of, that's kind of a tricky question. Cause I'd like to believe that it was the short answer is I think it's most likely Wayne. 
Okay. Because I mean, Manx I think, didn't see him. Yeah, I I I I, sweet. I guess I have to agree with that because I don't want to get into the weeds by saying, Oh, now Craig is a creative. I don't I don't think that. I then yeah. and if that's the case, then yeah. I don't think Craig manifested himself. But the only problem I have with, with the fact that Wayne did it is that Wayne doesn't know his dad. Wayne knows he died in the car. That's very true. She did tell him. He died in the car. That maybe, makes well, maybe then that just has something to do with it. Maybe the fact so, that he died in the backseat right, of the car. Right. I I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and say that I think it's All because right. he's beginning to turn. That makes sense. He's losing teeth. He's beginning to become a part of Manx's inscape, mm -hmm. and that mm -hmm. in turn mm -hmm. is allowing him to control the window and. It's his own right now. It's his own little world in there. So I mean, I don't want to get too deep of it. That's what that's what we think. So you know, feel free to to tell All us. Right, so then, way. so then the second part there did did his power awaken because of the wraith? So again, I'm not I'm not truly convinced that that Wayne that Wayne has a power being activated by that. I don't I don't I don't think so. I don't think so. And and this is me telling you that I don't remember from the book. So I, well, I, I don't, honestly I, can't. Yeah, I don't want I, you I to don't, answer it through the book. Well, I know. I'm just saying, like, I don't you have – I, I can't remember. So I don't have any, any ground to, like, right. base off of. Yeah, no, I don't well, think, that's good. I don't think it's – I think it's the Wraith. I think it's because he's in the Wraith and he's changing. That, yeah. That's my thing. So whatever – yeah, that, that's. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna think that too. I think that maybe okay. something within the wraith is the reason that his power kind of awakens. He's able to manipulate the door handle with his mind, right? If he I think, had... I still think that was the wraith. No, I don't think so. I think that was the wraith. Yeah, the wraith, because I mean, the wraith has its has a mind of its own. It's well, able my... to do. That's true. So that's true. I think I think that's true. I never really thought of it that way. That's that's all I'm saying because because that's what hmm. the wraith the wraith does is a little. That's true. Um, and uh, if that's the case, then maybe Wayne didn't have any kind of power at all. <laughs> well, that's my point. See, guys, that's my point. And the fact that Craig showed up, I immediately thought, yeah. Oh, he's a he's a let's say a vapor. He's a He's a memory in the Wraith of people who've died in the Wraith. Yeah, but the Wraith is also on Manx's side. Like, the Manx is... Oh, is, of course. Uh, the Wraith is Manx's life force. So why would the Wraith allow that to happen without See, Manx again, noticing it's that way? Knife, that so it's very, is... it's very weird. Or, because we're going to get to the Hourglass Man in, in a second. Mm. But if you're saying that, like, the and the fact that he's so connected to his Wraith, mm. we obviously see that... He gets hurt, but yeah. you know you hurt the rate you hurt Manx. If you if you if you if you busted up the hourglasses thing, hourglass yeah. does that hurt him? You know, but the thing is, I don't think that's true of everybody. I think it's just I think it's the amount of time, it's the amount of time and yourself that you've put into your knife. Yeah. Obviously, Vic's bikes, the triumph is totaled and she's fine. Yeah, she has a busted spleen, but that's because yeah. She well, everybody by a car. obviously Manx Manx is obviously special. That's all point well, of the right. So so anyway, so look, I, we I, I, yeah we, we spend a lot again, of time on this. So yeah, I, no, I, I mean it's it's a tough it's a tough question. I right, quickly, um, if Wayne did have that ability, mm -hmm. why wouldn't he have had the, the unroll the window and jumped out? That's and there you go. So that's the thing. That's why I believe it was the wraith that did it. I don't allowed, know. See, it's allowed. crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. But why would the wraith help Wayne what by getting because a what message? Happened? No, no, no. But what happened? He gave a message. Oh, you mean Craig, Craig gave a oh. message? No, no. To I don't Wayne think the wraith. See, at that point, about I'm his not mom saying, not giving up on him. No, no. That I'm not saying. That I'm just saying the 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 spirit <laughs> of Craig. Then maybe Craig did the manifest Holy himself. Spirit. I just realized something. My light fell. How do I look? Am I look okay? The light I mean, you look like you normally do. I don't know. I guess I look normal. Okay. Where are um, all right. So, yeah, that's a tough question. You guys let us know what you guys are thinking. I don't freaking know. Like, anyway. That's like bugged out. Uh, so, I want, we're gonna, in the same – so, in that same mm. in that same scenario, we have yeah. – um, uh, What is that? Thomas, right? Bing, Thomas's question? Well, no, no. I want to, Michelle, Michelle Gray Wolf, she's got a comment. I just want to go, oh, go oh, there okay, real quick okay, before okay, we okay. jump into well, – yeah. we're going to talk about being attacking Manx. Mm -hmm. And Michelle says – 
uh, you know, she's at a loss that Bing got the upper hand on Charlie. She says, mm -hmm. I just can't see that being said. How She just can't see that. Um, mm. But that being said, however, it's nice. It's a nice takeoff from the book. Uh, but I'm not sure I would believe it otherwise. So, you know, what she's That's, saying is it's yeah. it, that didn't. And I agree. It didn't happen in the book. That wasn't a thing. They're giving the show is giving Bing a little more power and making him a little more of a foil than he was than he put. And he was, yeah. Yeah. um, and then and then so we but you know now we have some questions about this. Yeah. Um. All right. So. I think Jesse said, didn't Jesse write something else about about? Um... Well, yeah. Well, 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 well. Yeah. Thomas and Jesse both have questions about it. Jesse had said, "What do you think Bing is trying to do with Manx at the you know at the?" Oh, end? okay, okay, yeah, because I didn't have it here. Um, yeah, so do you think Wayne Thomas Thomas writes to us? Do you think Wayne can escape now that Bing has attacked Manx? All right, so we have two things here. What is Bing mm. doing, and and can Wayne um, take advantage of that? Uh, I think we know what Bing's doing. Uh, well, yeah, Bing. He, he Bing... knows. He knows now what Manx um, was really going to do with him. Yeah. Uh, to to some extent, and he knows that. He's not necessarily going to go to Christmas land because he originally left with, with Wayne. Um, I mean, he's going to make him take is... him. He wants to, don't forget. He's still simple. He wants, he wants him to take him to Christmas land. I think, yeah. I think he's still going to like force him to say, yes, I'll take you to Christmas land and I won't feed you to my children. I think yeah. that's where he's at. I think that's what he's going to do, you know? And as okay. far, as, far okay. as Wayne escaping. Yeah. You no, know, I mean, at this, I mean, look, they, they, for lack of a better phrase, they've gone off book. So at this point, it's like, well, possibly, you know, he yeah. possibly could weaken Manx enough that. But then again, mm -hmm. then again, I'll say it again: the Wraith does have a mind of its own, and it didn't let. Yeah. It didn't as Manx was burning, in the end of season one, the Wraith didn't let Craig out. Like Craig couldn't escape. Remember when she yeah. when they were f squaring off, Vic and him, they couldn't. He couldn't escape still, so yeah. the wraith still has its own power. The wraith still has its own ability to keep whoever's in the car. So yeah. I, I don't think Wayne's. I don't think Wayne's going anywhere. I don't think I don't think Wayne's going anywhere either. I think somehow or another, Manx is going to get the upper hand. Um, could this be the last we see of Bing? If if Manx is able to get away or 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 you know just have have the ability to fight back against Bing, um, why would he keep him alive? You know, so yeah. I really think that this could be the end of Bing. Yeah, I mean, I know, I'm not yeah, sure. Yeah, Can he run off again like he them. did? Or yeah, I don't know what they're doing with Bing. I yeah, don't know, I don't know what the point of what they're doing is with this, but I guess we'll see next yeah. episode. Yeah. Um. All right. So let's. So that's that. Let's. Uh. You know. Obviously, mm. let us know what you guys think. Um. Uh, we're going to transition now. Let's go to the Hourglass Man. Um, you know, uh, what do we got? Oh, Phil. This Phil, is Phil and Jesse. And yeah. Jesse, yeah. You know, they say, um, is this really the end of the Hourglass Man? Phil wants to know. And Jesse, you know, says, do you think the Hourglass is done without his knife? So, obviously, we know Maggie mm -hmm. shows up. And, on, by the way, finds a way to control her thing now yeah which is cool she kind of learned something okay so now i was least. waiting for this because remember when i was saying like yeah but she never had that problem before so yeah, yeah in the if i remember correctly and again if you've read this you can correct me if i'm wrong in the book that's what she did yeah she smoked and she and she hurt her she did that to to control when maggie yeah, meets i don't her. believe the hourglass is in the hourglass no, man is in the novel no right? he's not he's he's somebody yeah. in fact i put an article about that in the in our facebook group okay yeah okay. that joe hill just like walked by the writer's room was like hey i have an idea for a very for a new strong creative a strong new creative or whatever you want yeah. so he's he's made new for this which is cool which is fine mm -hmm, but yeah mm -hmm. but maggie that's how maggie used to um, and I can hear the because I, I listen to the audiobook at work and I can hear the the narrator's voice for Maggie. It's like this. She's yeah. like, ah, Maggie. Um, <laughs> and uh, I like I liked her voice. Yeah. Um, but uh, yeah. So, yeah. So I was waiting for that to show up. Like, that's the yeah. way Maggie knows how to do it. So anyway, so he, he go he shows her how to do that. We find out a lot of dude. There's a there's a big bug behind your head. Wow. I'm like, I heard something. Look to your right. Look to your right. 
oh my god, it's a huge ass freaking wasp thing or something. Yeah. All right, hang on. <laughs> Summer bugging happens so fast. Damn. Summer, Summer bugging. bugging. My, went over Mike's ass. <laughs> All right, so Yo, we're, dude. we're back. That was nuts. Mike had a little uh, bug problem. A little, you, had to do a little you know, like I heard like a little like clink, clink. Like clink, the clank, hall. you heard a little quick, clink. And I'm like, I don't want to like. I saw, I'm like, that is that way? on my screen? I'm like, what is that? And then, yeah. And then I guess um, it was like, yeah, that bugging. was weird, bro. Yeah, man, it was. It wanted. It had. It had its own two cents. It wanted to talk about the hourglass, man. Yeah, I mean. Uh, all right. Um, so, so okay. anyway, so like we were saying, so yeah, Maggie. Yeah. So he he teaches Maggie that. Um, yeah. He. So what I was gonna say before we mm -hmm. so rudely now I'm like itchy, bro. Now nah, you're good, man. I'll keep. I'll keep watch for you. It's fine. <laughs> all right. So basically, what I'm saying is, we learned. We learned a bunch of stuff that one. I wrote in my notes, I wrote down, okay, so people don't don't necessarily have to kill themselves. He just makes them kill themselves. And we find out that by him taking their lives, he gets he to that. He gains their he gains their time or something. That's what he says. He says right. um what I wrote it down like He says, Am I gonna and he he makes her check her tiles as if he's gonna be immortal and she says no. It yeah. says the bag the tiles say no, and he gets pissed off. So he can gain life by taking life. He can gain life. No, 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 time. no, no, no. What, what he no, said? No, he gains memory. He doesn't lose his memory. He thought he could get their time, but he's wrong. That's what it was. Is that what he said? Yes, because he's like the first twenty years of my life. I don't remember. He's the last twenty years of my life. I I remember crystal clear because I'm taking their juice. So it's it's okay, not. Okay. So, but he says, but. I was also wondering if I was taking their time as well. That's what okay. he thought. Right, maybe that's what I and 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 he and obviously that's not how it works. And and yeah. he, again he brings up because Manx. It's interesting because he doesn't obviously know that she knows Manx, and so he mentions, "Do you know Manx? Mm -hmm. He's managed to do it, and if he can do it, I can do it." Yeah. So that's yeah. his whole point. So yeah. long story short, she busts mm -hmm. up his knife. Now, the, okay, so. I do you think? Do you think it's the end of the hourglass man? And do you think? I think. He, I think he's done. Yeah, I think he's done. I don't think so. I, and I'll tell you why. He did that. He did that dramatic. Oh. But if you look, yeah, but he didn't die. He just kind of like moved. I watched it twice. I, I rewound it to see if it looked like he uh, died. Let me explain. Let's let's talk about this. Yes. Vicky loses. She's lost her knife multiple times. Okay. And she didn't die. So she's not yeah, connected to her. Yeah, but everybody's different. Though. I understand that, but why? But why is he connected? But he didn't to his die. Life? He didn't die because of the 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 hourglass breaking. He died because Maggie shoved the fucking piece of glass. Oh in his well, if that yeah, I mean, if that's what you want to say, I thought I he died. He he's not immortal. Well, that was his whole well, well obsession. You know, one with of the Max. questions we have is: Do you think the hourglass is done without his knife? If you're saying if if we're answering that question, I believe no, he's not done without his well, knife. Well, I, th I think he just no, has to no, find no. a new knife. Is he well, done because he got dead. stabbed? I don't yes. think he's no. It's I don't yes. think he's gonna die. I think it's he'll get. I think he'll be. He'll call. He'll make his way over to the phone and call the hotel and get a you know ambulance. Like I don't think. Okay, he's maybe, but still, and then if that's but the case, then no, he could neutral. possibly he's find neutralized. another. She, maybe he'll yeah. find a stopwatch, or maybe he'll find a. He found it once before. He'll do it again. But I'm just saying, yeah. right now, That's I don't very think. True. All but right. it's a good. Okay. But it's a good. You know, he stopped for now, and yeah. it could come back to and bite Maggie in the ass afterwards. Yeah. So okay. Um. All right. So uh. Yeah. So that. I think that. the last one is. Yeah. I think the last one. I mean, cool question. Um. From Sean. Uh. Do you think Vic's parents have any kind of creative abilities? Strong creative abilities. I do not think they do. Well, I mean, look, technically we all do. That's the point. It's just there are people who can, who it's who are stronger than others. So technically, yeah. I would say yes. But well, based off of the show and what it's about, and the and the. I mean, they they don't have access to it. No, I mean, no, yeah, they, no. they don't have access to it. Yeah. But again, yeah. the point is, everyone does. That's that's the mm -hmm. whole point, and it's just strong creators are the ones that can yeah. access the ability and figure out how to cut through reality um yeah i so. don't i don't necessarily think so either i don't really think we've gotten any kind of evidence in this season or even last season that would give us that idea 
could they throw a little monkey wrench in and all of a sudden someone does something, his father does something, the mother does something, and all of a sudden they're like, wow, I should have been dead. Or now, it, like, you know, some kind of like we as the viewers see the gift, you know. Um, I mean, uh, allow hey, listen, itself to be conscious of, to them. Not out of the realm of possibility, yeah, but I, I don't will think say. So I think it would get a little. I think it would be a little much. A little know. much. It now would kind of like, hey, like everyone's. What are we super family? Yeah, dumb down like yeah. the um, the actual gift itself. Right. By oh no, this guy has this guy has a Craig hazard. No, uh, but I will tell you, I am yeah. I am glad to see Chris and Linda back together, and and that they know now. I like that. Yeah. I like that it's Lou. Well, that's and like a her super parents. bond. I yeah. like that. I like that. I'm, I, you know, I like that. Chris was like, "Well, I was a piece of shit. Sorry." Mm -hmm. Like he, yeah. you know, I mean, he has admitted it before, but he's like, "But now he's again, he's owing it up to Linda." Linda's yeah, like, you, you, hmm. "You never saw it or something." Yeah. You, you know, you had a husband that you know was beating you, and you were just yeah, trying to a hide the piece of garbage. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. So I don't know. I like it. I like I like where they're at now. So mm -hmm. hey, listen, mm -hmm. it's episode six. We've still got four more. Um. Three, no, it's ten, right? What are we seven, at? Seven, eight, nine. Seven, eight, oh no, nine, four. Ten. That yeah. makes sense. Okay. <laughs> I think I had that issue before. It's like another. I know it's maths, man. Yeah, uh, I know <laughs> three plus. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. I... Anyway, look, that's gonna do us. That's 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 enough stuff. We've had enough excitement right. yes. for one night. Yeah. Uh, I will yeah. say thank you, everyone, for your questions and your comments. Keep Absolutely, coming. we for appreciate that. Poll. Yeah. Mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. join our Facebook group and also join the Nosferatu yeah. fans uh, Facebook group they're gracious yeah. enough to let us post our videos and stuff in there we're in there yes. too um, that's, that's also in the linked, description that's yeah. linked below so join both of those groups and uh, yeah that's it man yeah that's it I mean uh, check us out at Third Person Pod and all the social media outlets we always post uh, when we're going to be doing videos and when to get those questions and everything in so we really appreciate uh, appreciate that again just like Chris said it's so awesome when you guys can um Give us some feedback about what you're thinking oh, yeah. uh, by watching Nosferatu because these are just cool videos for us because we just love answering that stuff. So, again, thank you so much. We got about four more episodes left of Nosferatu. I know oh, a lot of people are say exactly yeah, four more episodes. Exactly four more episodes. There's, <laughs> um, I've seen some, uh, some people talking about how they haven't renewed for season three. I don't know if it's, if it's um, AMC feeling that the show is not successful enough or not or if they just feel like they can end it perfectly by having two seasons and that's it but i do know and i believe i don't know if you know this chris but he's also had books before prequels of nasaratu with the race itself i don't Joe think Hill. i knew that yeah so there are stories with the wraith before it got to um max mm-hmm um, from what I hear, I believe, or they might have been, I could, don't quote me on it. It's its either they were after this story with more stories of the Wraith or before. I am not 100% sure. I know it's one of the two. Let me know in the in the yeah. comment section below. We'll look it because up. I think there are more stories with just the Wraith itself. Well, you know, also because of the pandemic, I think thing, a lot of things are up in the air. Mm. So, you know, I, I, I also That's put, true too. That's I true. put the... Um, I haven't had a chance to watch the Comic Con panel, uh, yeah. But I did put that in in, in our Facebook group. So if you yeah. want to go check that out, if you haven't already, or look it up on YouTube, it's it's, it's YouTube. It's a, yeah. it's a link to YouTube anyway. So, uh, but it's right there in our Facebook group. It's the Comic Con mm -hmm. at Home panel for Nosferatu. Uh, yeah, I mean, I I, I so I, I I can't answer that. I haven't I haven't watched yeah. that panel yet. I haven't had a chance, but. Uh, I plan on doing that. Just see whatever whatever information they give us about that stuff. So if you guys know, then let all us right. know in the comments. Yeah. Um, all right. That's it. Thank you for watching. Right. We love you guys. Stay safe um, and stay cool. And we'll see you next time. <laughs> and watch out for those bugs. Summer bugging. <laughs> Had me a blast. Sting in my ass. Summer bugging. <laughs>